Hey YouTube, this is Molly, Griffin Finder here. I'm going to be cooking stuffing um, with some onions. I'm going to saute some onions. I don't think I'm going to get any of that on film, but I'll show you the food after it's sauteed. And then I'm going to saute with it with celery. I'm making turkey stuffing for Thanksgiving. I have a huge ass turkey. I have a huge turkey in the fridge. And tomorrow is Thanksgiving, so that's why I'm doing all this. But I will get to you when I have everything pulled up and that I'm ready to record. Okay, I have eight cups of dried breadcrumbs. Um, I need a half a cup of celery, so I'm gonna cut this up and then I'm gonna count. I'm gonna put it in the cup. I feel like my makeup videos aren't enough, but I'm gonna make a video of everything I'm just going to talk while I'm cutting it. But I'm not really good at makeup. I only wear what I want to. Um, I think next, I'm going to do this on Wednesdays. I think next Wednesday I'm going to do a mask. But tomorrow, the, this is going to be like a holiday special where I record for the holiday. Okay, let's see if this is a half a cup. I don't know if it is. I'm just gonna cut the celery up real small because I don't like the taste of it. You know, cutting them up real small. Um, but I want to record the Thanksgiving prep. I'm not gonna. I might do like a different video for um I might do a different video for like the finishing touch of the turkey. Or if you guys follow me on my Facebook, if you put in Melissa Wheaton Hansen on Facebook, you can add me on there. I also have a Twitter and an Instagram and a Snapchat with Missy123 Law. Um I don't know if my Twitter is the Missy123 Law. I know one of them ended up having issues logging in and I made another one with a different user. And if it doesn't work, if you don't see the turkey on those, then um, check out the five, Missy 504 Haw on my Twitter. If it's not that, I don't know though. I usually have it posted on my other, my other uh, YouTube videos. I'm gonna post it in the description box down below if you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up. Um, I'm just gonna cut the rest of these and then I will show you them going into a pan to saute with butter. Okay, I have half of a cup of celery. I'm just gonna put it as that because I don't like a lot of celery. It's pretty tough. I wanna tenderize it in the butter before I put it in the stuffing, which I'm gonna record that part too. Um, so yeah, I'll get back when I whip out the onion. I gotta say, some feedback your eyes will cry when you cut up onion I cut up the onion as small as I could too because I don't really like the crunch but I'm also gonna saute it so I'll show you what it looks like in the saute when I'm when I'm done because I have, I have it a forward camera I'm just gonna use it all because I worked hard on it, so why not? Oh god, I'm not crying, y'all. I just cut some onions, that's all. But I'll be back when I'm done sauteing, or mid saute, if you guys want to see the action. I'm making the sauteing in the pan. You hear that sizzle? You hear that sizzle? I don't know if you could see it, but it's starting. That's how much onions. I use a half a cup of each. If you have eight cu uh, cups of cubed dried bread or cubed toast or whatnot, 
I used a half a cup because I can't handle the whole cup, especially for especially for onions. My eyes, eyes were burning and stuff, so I'm going to let you watch the action. But yeah, my eyes were burning, and you guys able to see it? Yeah, you are. Okay, well, I need to let this... There's so much butter it asked for, so I'm going to let it get nice and sautéed and cooked before I put it in, this, in the stuffing. Once it cools off, I'll put it in there because, yeah, I don't know if you guys can see. Camera is right here, so you guys can see it like that. Nice and we want to make it nice and golden and heat it up. I'm making it low sodium, so I'm going to cut out the salt, which you can put two and a quarter cups of salt. My stove is messy from today's meals. But, um, you get it nice and cooked. But if you want salt, you could put two and a quarter cups of salt. The salt I have in the stuffing already is enough. And my, son, my husband has a congestive heart failure. So, he, it's like, he can't really, you know... I think I should have put a little bit more butter, only because it's supposed to have butter in it too, not just the, not just to saute the vegetables in, but to actually have in the thing. And I'm using a lighter butter. There's also unsalted butter if you have congestive heart failure. If you have congestive heart failure, keep the salt out of the equation. I don't have it in this equation because. I can't have salt and I want my husband to have a good Thanksgiving. That oh he could eat just like us. You know? I have it on high. You'll want to do that so you can cook cook it up. And yeah. I'll let you watch it. You can sizzle. Oh yeah, that's part of the stuffing. Oh, it's sucking up the butter. I don't want it to. I want to put all this. It asked for that much butter, so that's what I did. It's going to go all up in a big set of stuffing, which is going to go in the turkey so it has that poultry taste. And don't get Jenny O unless you're living in my town. And if you guys know me in real life, you would know where I live. I'm not going to put it out there though. So, I'm going to let these brown and then I'll come back to you. I'm actually going to put the chicken stock in, which is the chicken broth. One and a half cups. And then I'm going to put one large egg into the bread part. Let the... The vegetables cool before I put it in there so it doesn't cook the egg. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna make it like that and I'm gonna just put it in the turkey early in the morning and I'm gonna do a video of that too. You guys are gonna see me put prep the turkey as well, which is gonna be unsalted. Like all the unsalted seasonings, I'm not gonna put too much, I'm not gonna put any spices. I might put onion powder on the top of it and some oregano or something all over it just to make it have a pizzazz. But I'm going to put the one and a half cups of turkey or chicken. This is the best if you have congestive heart failure. It only has 40 milligrams of sodium. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I'm going to put one in. Uh, uh, I'm going to put half, three quarters of a cup of this because I'm, I don't have all 10 or all 13 cups of cubed dried cubed bread sorry I struggled go oh, this is all I'm gonna put in it because it's not a lot so food right there um 
well for a family of nine it's not but you can't see it because I didn't fill it up all the way because I don't want to because it says for one and a half for 13 so I'm going to cut everything in half put that and the egg inside the bread which is right here and put it in there already and I'm going to put one egg in there I'm going to put in this just in case I get a shell in there it stopped sizzling the vegetables stopped sizzling um what was I going to do? oh yeah an egg A lot of leftovers in there um but one egg and eight cups of cube bread crack it open my nails are crap so i can't really pry it open with my nails i actually almost snapped my fingernail off yeah but you got my hands you might want to get rid of it Sure, no shells because it's going to be put in turkey. If you can't save it last minute, my hands are washed, they were washed since I wanted to cook it. I'm going to smush up all the liquids into the bread and then I may put a second egg, I don't know. Depends on how all this plant pans out because see turning it into stuffing it's not soft like a or it was not hard like I wanted it but it's gonna be smushed up anyway so bread is bread I don't know if there's like another Way of making homemade stuffing like from scratch like scratch where there's not bread because they use the bread for the yeast so I'm wondering what they use like just flour or yeah this is just enough to put in the turkey I should use the whole loaf I didn't use the whole loaf this is wheat bread whole wheat bread is probably the best you want to use bread or you can make scratch bread with no salt which would probably be even better for anybody that has issues with salt and this is the outcome I got on my hair when I dyed it if anybody was wondering because I dyed it and I said it was a fail it kind of was but it came out pretty because I dropped it. <laughs> okay, and now I'm gonna see how cooled off the vegetables are because the bread part is done except for the things that I need in it. Okay, I'm gonna add some pepper as well. I'm just gonna put a palm, bit in my palm. I've always made it with my hands with my grandma and everything and she's not here I might do like a little haul of all the things my grandma has like picked up throughout the years for Christmas um, and show you what she had got and that I kept because it was sentimental with me but um, I'm gonna get back to you when I find out if the vegetables are uh, cooled off enough. I have to dry my hand. Okay, I'm going to show you guys the finishing product of the stuffing prep. This is all prep. It's not going to get cooked. It's not going to get cooked till I put in the turkey. Which, if you want enough to put in the turkey, 8 cups of bread, cr bread cubes is enough. If you want a lot for a good amount of family I would use a whole loaf or more but this is what I got out of eight cubes of bread so you know what you're looking at when you do it 
Oh. Sorry, my phone's on the charger. This is what you're looking at. You're seeing it for eight eight cups of cubed bread. But that's what is going to happen. If you like this video, because I'm gonna put another one up tomorrow for Thanksgiving. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe if you want to see more videos. I do beauty, um, sometimes story time, and cooking videos. Not so much of cooking videos, though, but you will see them on my channel. Um, you guys can request some cooking items. I can get the recipe and the items that I need, and I can show you how to make it down. Just comment it down below, and I will get to it, and... Hopefully, yeah. I will put my Facebook on here if you guys want to add me on Facebook. But you have to tell me, hey, this is so-and-so from YouTube. And I will add you and we can keep in touch. Um, I'm now married, which that's great. <laughs> um, but yeah. So yeah, I'm not going to say it again because I'll just go in a loop. But... Thank you guys and have a good good night.